against the dollar for the third straight day, as UK industrial production rose more than forecast in September. Prompted by a rebound in manufacturing, data released by the Office for National Statistics outlined that industrial production rose 2.2% year-on-year in September, followed by a 1.5% drop in August. Experts are attributing today's figures to an increase in mining and quarrying, supported by an elevation in basic pharmaceuticals, transport equipment and consumer and electrical products within the manufacturing industry. The sterling has gained 4.2% in the past six months and showed almost across-the-board advances against its 16 major peers in trading this week. Taking a look at the cable and the pound sterling has extended gains on the dollar, with Jane Foley of Rabobank commenting that a positive industrial production figure did have the capacity to push the pound a bit higher against the dollar. While looking at the euro pound cross, and sterling has climbed to its strongest in a month versus the single currency. Market insiders are hopeful today's figures could turn into a positive cyclical effect for the UK economy. Commenting prior to the release of the data, Howard Archer of IHS Global Insight said, Manufacturers will be hoping that the recent extended good news on the UK economy further lifts business and consumer confidence, which in turn translates into sustained higher demand. Data released by Market Economics this week is already suggestive of an accelerated start to the quarter, supported by the European Commission and CBI's upwardly revised growth figures also published this week. It's hoped that BOE Governor Mark Carney will confirm these estimates when he presents new quarterly forecasts next Wednesday. Sterling watchers will have their eye on the Bank of England rate decision meeting tomorrow. It's anticipated that central bank policy makers will maintain interest rates at a record low 0.5%, with no change to the asset purchase stimulus target at £375 billion. I'll be back tomorrow to take a look at that rate decision, so until then, goodbye.